Okay, I've carried the Norwalk juicer over to the sink and the next step is to dilute some soap and water and spray it down here to absorb any oil or juice. And most juicers are much worse than this one. And what you want to do is get a used toothbrush and scrub in here as I'm doing here as many times as you need to to get it clean. Now this one is relatively clean but it's got something that looks oily down here. I think we have a small oil leak which we'll have to check for later. So after you give it a thorough scrubbing if you don't have a sink like mine where you can tip it in with a spray nozzle to spray it you can do this outdoors with a hose but you want to be careful not to get all your electrical things wet so what I'm going to do is I'm going to give it another cleaning let this soap and water soak for a little bit and we'll clean it up there as well. So while that's soaking, we'll make the end of this little clip and um, we'll go to the next video later. I hope you like what you see. If you do, please tell a friend. Okay, there we have the juicer all cleaned and dried off with paper towels. And now that we have it clean, I'll carry it back into the shop. And we'll go to the next video.